It's Friday and I've decided I'm gonna start this week's vlog early and the reason for that is because it's the big week. It's the week that we get the car but it's also the week that plans have changed so nothing goes back on the Thursday. Not the Friday like we originally thought so the idea of going to Skegness has gone out the window for two reasons. A. We're not gonna have the time. B. It's raining. It's gonna rain pretty much all the next week so it's officially autumn in the UK. So yeah. I'm chilling in bed in my Harry Potter jumper because I'm cold and I'm just watching YouTube. I never got a chance to upload this week's vlog because it took forever but I have actually got a video uploading on Sunday so I can just upload the vlog as an extra because I have already Wednesday's video ready. I need to film the MacBook video tomorrow. Tomorrow is Saturday. And I need to clean the car, empty the car out. I need to film my MacBook video. Film the end, beginning and ending to my tattoo part two video. I need to edit all those and then I can upload them during the week. I also need to tidy up this bedroom. And I need to scrub at the seat where Nathan sits on the floor, but Dad reckons he can help me with that on Sunday, so maybe that will be a Dad job on Sunday. And I thought I'd bring you guys along with me, so if you didn't know, um, we are swapping the car over on the 1st, which is a Tuesday, and to... From, right, so we're swapping the car over and we are swapping the car from a Kia Sportage to a Kia, not a Kia, a Hyundai Tucson. Um, I'll leave the link down below and I'll leave pictures. This is the Kia, this is the Hyundai. I will do a whole Hyundai video for you, a separate one to show you what's currently in the car and how I hope to keep it, but with Nathan about, that's not always how that happens. It has a decent sized boot for Nathan's push chair. You can lower the floor, so that is something that I will probably do. But yeah, there's a lot going on this weekend, so I thought I'd bring you guys along with me. <sighs> and now I'm just gonna relax for the evening, and I will see you all tomorrow. Good morning, guys. It's not morning, or well, afternoon, guys. It's 1.21 and I am quickly heading to the shop because there's a couple of bits I want and I have a Tesco voucher that I can use so I'm going to grab that. I've grabbed that and I'm going to quickly go buy the stuff I want and then I can be done for the day. Um, I need to empty the car out as well today so that's another job we'll be doing together. So yeah, I feel that's actually happening. And today I just thought I'd fill you in. I had a bit of a slow morning so I feel quite like myself right now. So that might warrant a trip to the doctors about sort of my mood and stuff. But there's a whole separate section of the vlog. Um, just in a comfy jumper, st jumper style, a jumper top and my jeans. I'm just going to our local Tesco. Normally I'd walk but because I have to empty the car out I thought I could do some, go in the car, do some shopping and then empty the car out once I got home and take in some of the bits with the shopping. So and then I only have to go out once more and, and grab whatever's left and do a check. So I'll see you when I'm doing that. It is now actually half past three. I've been home for like two hours from the shop. I got everything I wanted. I have chocolate milk. You can see crisps and stuff in the background. I got an hamburger I did to go with my lunch. I feel really full and I also got problems and I ate way too many. I emptied some of the car out already. I need to go down there and empty as much as possible. I also need to find some tools to take Nathan's harness off. I'll show you what I mean. If you didn't know, Nathan is autistic. And so, because he gets himself out of the normal seatbelt, 
we had to buy him a racing style. I can see my milkshake. Uh, we had to buy him a racing style harness, which works with his car seat to the normal car seat belt. So we have to take that off because it's ours. It's not. It didn't go with the car. Um, and I also need to check that everything's out from the boot other than his push chair because we're just going to switch that from that for the car to the next. To be honest, I'll probably just get the push chair out and put Nathan in it. On Tuesday, I'll probably just take the push chair out of the boot, set it up and put Nathan in the push chair because A, it contains him in one particular spot and B, it just means that I'm only having to swap over like the car seat and all that stuff. So yeah um let's go and do that even though i'm in pj's i can't be bothered to change so i'm just gonna be in my pj's so i've already taken nathan's push chair out and i've covered it with this cover just because it's lightly raining so i just want to make sure the seat doesn't get too wet i'm now going to empty the boot out because it looks like this the boot ladies and gentlemen needs a good clean out so i'm gonna do that and then i'll show you what it looks like after. I brought my granddad last Christmas one of these personalized vintage signs. I'll leave all their stuff linked down below. They were a really good gift. Actually my granddad and Nick really loved them. So good gift idea guys. So this is my boot after the fact. I still need to vacuum it but I'm gonna do the vacuuming once I've fully emptied it and wiping down like the plastic and stuff, these are the bags I'm using to put everything away. Put so vacuum, scrub down, pick up and bag all of this. And that is the harness I was on a route. So I need to get that off as well. But I might need dad's help for that, so let's hope for the best. I also need to clean, wash his seat cover. So you've just seen me clean out the car. I'm doing a whole separate video on the car swap itself. So some of the footage will be in that. If you wanna see the car swap video, I'll have it linked in this video and also in the iCard. And if you go check out my Instagram and things like that, it will be linked there too. I'm slightly out of breath because I did it as fast as I could because it started raining on me. Dad is going to be the one hand. So my dad is the one that's going to clean the inside of the car and the reason for that is he's bigger than me, he's also a little bit stronger than I am so he'll be able to take a hard brush and actually sweep in there properly as well as vacuum and scrub any of the areas that need a good scrub. So my dad's going to do all that tomorrow so that he has a full kind of six hours to do it because I don't pick Nathan up until about four-ish. And then we won't be using the car Monday, but we will use it on Tuesday to go swap the cars. And the reason for that is because we're getting a low on fuel, plenty enough to get us to, for me to go get Nathan and then get us to the garage. But we don't want to put any more fuel in if we don't have to. <sighs> I'm going to get a cold drink. I do have a milkshake upstairs, but I'm going to get a cold drink from the fridge. And now I'm just going to relax, possibly edit. And I will see you all tomorrow when I pick Nathan up. morning guys it's not even morning it is afternoon and it's two o'clock um we have just been chilling all day i'm literally in a jumper and some pj pants we are currently watching it thomas and friends here's the puppy uh i have this week's video already set to go live so i need to film but i'm not entirely sure what I'm going to film, I still need to do all my research on her illness. But she's doing so much better. Tomorrow is the big car swap day. It's also the day we're going to go Meadow Hall. 
So we're going to try and cram and get as much done tomorrow as possible. So we have, we're leaving here at 10.30. We're also getting Nathan into a, before I go into the schedule, we're trying to get Nathan back into a routine. So Nathan used to eat at sort of seven, then he'd have a snack at school at 10, he'd eat his lunch at 12, and then he'd eat another snack at about half past two. So I'm gonna wear a gun down in a minute and get us some snacks. And then he'd eat with us at like half six-ish. So that's what we're trying to get him back into. And tomorrow we need to leave here by half past 10 at the latest so that we can, so Nathan will be eating snack on the go or just before we leave. So he'll have an early snack, I think. Um, but we need to drop off the repeat prescript request for Nathan and mum's meds. Then we have to drive to the car garage. We have to be there for 11. It takes about 45 minutes to do all the paperwork. I probably won't film any of that, but we'll see. And then we are gonna go put fuel in the car. The dog staying behind is okay for her to stay at home. But I do think we have the um, nanny cam. So I might move that into the living room if I can find it um because that should be in Nathan's room so we can keep an eye on her and then we are going to eat lunch while we're out which is not something we necessarily want to do but to keep him on his food schedule because school will feed him around 12-ish I need to make sure that he's used to that then we will do last minute clothes shopping and we also need to pick him up another jumper another pair of trousers more socks because all his school socks have gone missing we also need to pick him up a new lunch box and sippy cup for school so they're just his and then oh we need to pick up juice for school as well and that's it oh and some food items so yeah not a lot's happening tomorrow will be the busy day and hopefully i remember to film as much of it as i can and I'll see you guys later. Evening all, it's 20 to seven. I have a no strip on because I haven't pumped my myself in a while. Nathan is starting to relax, ready to go to bed. So once he's in bed, I'm gonna jump in the bath because my tattoo is actually officially water, like bath worthy. I might actually only have a shower depending how I feel. These I got from Amazon, so I'll link them down below for you guys. And we're just prepping for tomorrow. Uh, I need to, before I get done in the bath, I need to run down to the car once he's in bed and actually empty the last little bits and bobs. So my phone holder, the sh pair of shoes that's still in the car from the night, um, and any like little bits we missed. So I like to just double check everything, throw things in the bin if they're not needed. I know there's an empty can in there that needs to go in the bin and that'll be everything and that'll only be Nathan's my purse Nathan my face mask Nathan's car seat and Nathan's oh push chair so it just makes my idea actually I think I'm gonna put the paperwork in the car as well so that it's in there uh, Nathan's getting fussy so I'm gonna deal with him and I will see you all tomorrow Good morning, it is, half, well, it's actually 20 to nine. Uh, we got up late today because Nathan had a bit of a rough night. He got up at three and didn't go back to sleep till four, gone four. Um, so we didn't get as much sleep as we normally would, but I still feel good, I still feel refreshed. We are gonna go down in a few minutes and go get some food. He is not wearing a top just because he was so warm last night. Uh, the weather at the beginning of the week said it was gonna rain. It's now super sunny, you can see it in the corner, but that's okay. Um, I didn't go and empty the car out like planned last night, but then again, as I said, there's only the phone holder, his car seat, the push chair, and any like little bits and bobs. I need to go put the paperwork in the car as well. You can see my puppy, she's like, that's me too. Um, she needs her medication as well, so I need to go do that. Um, oh, sorry, baby. Did you do here is nearly breakfast? Did you do here is nearly breakfast? Oh, hello. 
my dad will be on his way soon because he's going to be here for about half past nine, so he'll be here in the next 15 minutes. And I need to start getting ready because we need to go in two hours, so... Well, less than that in the next, like, hour and 50 minutes, so... Oh, let me get that out of your eye. There you go. She had fluff or something in her eye. So, yeah, lots to do today. Lots to do. So, back in the bedroom. It is... Five o'clock. My feet hurt. But we officially swapped the car. Now, I would have filmed this process because the process used to take 45 minutes. But, I'm sorry if you can hear the iPad. We're in there for 10 minutes, if that. It was crazy. I didn't have to sign any paperwork. My dad didn't have to sign any paperwork. The only person who had to sign anything was my mom. So if you didn't know, we have a mobility car. It gets changed every three years. And if you have mobility, you need the higher rate of mobility, so the mobility section of PIP. I'll link the government website down below. If you think you're entitled to PIP, go check it out. You go in, you decide the car you want, you decide if you need to pay an advance payment, etc., etc., And you go from there. And... So, we went in, we literally swapped keys over, mum signed the piece of paper so we could take the car, we left. It's never been that quick before, so we were kind of surprised. And then we went to Meadow Hall and I didn't get to film anything in there because I had Nathan attached to my hand for much the whole process. Then we went for lunch. We went to Brewers Fair, which has the two for eight ninety nine lunch menu on again. So we had a good lunch. Now we won't need to eat later. I messaged my friend Amy because she messaged me. And we are going to have a cup of tea or something tomorrow. There's a pub near Dad's um, that we're going to sit down and catch up at, I think. Um, and... Oh, we also went and got Nathan a coat as well. I need to go put the seat covers in the car. The mats that go on the floor. And that's kind of it. Yeah. All happy. That it's quarter past nine. I'm still mums. I would normally go to dad's, but... It's been one of those weeks. Um, all the paperwork for the car. So this is like all the insurance, well not insurance paperwork, uh, the mobility stuff. So I'm just gonna stick it up on the side. I always keep them in a folder. There is a pen in there that I need to take out. <coughs> but I would very much recommend the Hyundai garage. I mean, we went to our local one, which was the Beecham, Beachdale um, Mona group. And the guy we dealt with was Tom Porter. I will link him down below for you guys. Not link him. I'll link the website down below with his name if you live in this area. I want to go check out that Hyundai garage. I just want to check out the Tucson. And I will see you all tomorrow. Hey guys, so I haven't filmed since Tuesday and there's multiple reasons for that. I went out yesterday to spend time with a friend, so it just wasn't my priority. And I then forgot and by the time I got home I didn't feel like filming so I wasn't going to. This morning I would have filmed but we were running late. We are dropping Nathan off today and tomorrow to school but then he gets picked up by the school bus next Monday. He is going back to school. All is good. So I have 
about 90 minutes. It's half past 12. I need to leave here by 10 past 2. So, like an hour and a bit. No, an hour and a bit. Like an hour and 40. Just under two hours. To kind of do a little bit of tidying up and maybe actually go get a quick shot of the car for you guys to see. My room even though you can't actually see it because it's blurred, it is a mess so I need to do that. I think I'm going to quickly do some turning up, put clothes away, then I'll go get a quick shot of the car and show you the inside on how, what I've got in that for now. It probably will change as time goes on. Oh, I've got to get stuff out of the boot as well. So, let's go do that. Oh, he to face in this trashy bar Another glass and I am going places Makes me laugh about the irony of everything I like the way you're thinking I don't really care about the music on the dance floor I don't really mind all the smoke is in the back
So I did a little bit of picking up and surprisingly the room looks better. All I've got to do is put clothes away. So yeah, I'm happy. Bed is made. Dirty clothes have been thrown out. Clothes that need to go in the bin have been put in the bin. And now I'm going to put this one right here because I have put it off for a couple of days. And as I said, Nathan is at school, so all is good. So I'm going to do that. Then I'll show you the car. The car? Oh. I will do a more in-depth video. This is just a quick glimpse. This mess I just up from this morning. There is here. Yeah. Bigger car, happy girl. So it is quarter past five and I am going to end the vlog here. You saw a glimpse of the car and I will do a more in-depth video separately. I am now going to... Mm -hmm. I... I'm going to now get Nathan ready to start relaxing before I did a go to bed. And I will see you all next week. Bye, guys.